Uh, I am Dr. Alexey Pryakin, uh, MD, PhD. I'm course director of anatomy and embryology course, and I'm here today with uh, my teaching assistant, Gary, MD2 student. Today we will demonstrate a little uh, features of uh, anatomy table uh, device that we are using to conduct anatomy classes along with cadavers. Anatomy table is device uh, that allows to do a virtual uh, three-dimensional dissection. Uh, here we have uh, a body, a male body, and uh, you can just rotate it in different planes of the space. You can see the back and all other parts. You can select what you are able to see. And here you see muscles and blood vessels. So you remove superficial layers. If you click the structure, if you click the muscle, it will give you the name, uh, pectoralis major, right one. You can uh, change the color of the muscle. You can put a label of the muscle. You can remove the muscle or make it uh, semi-transparent to see structures underneath and it is uh, one of the features of uh, anatomy table that we are using commonly. Along with that we can use a drawing tool that can allow us to draw something, write something, and uh, demonstrate uh, the better. Uh, we can have uh, arrows as well. So yeah, uh, that is a very small set of things that we are, we are using on the regular basis during our anatomy labs. From a student standpoint, the anatomy table really helps supplement our learning, especially for the lab. It allows us to see structures that are normally too small or maybe uh, blend in too well with other tissues on the cadaver. The, uh, another good option for this is it actually allows us to make cuts that you normally wouldn't be able to do on a cadaver. Uh, for example, you can do a like a transverse cut and then you just click the part you don't want to see anymore. It'll vanish and then you just rotate. And now you can see structures from a, uh, an inferior view. So that way you're able to see structures and you can still touch and label. And it'll label whatever it is that you are looking at at that point. Um, this really helped out during um, our online learning portion during COVID uh, because we were able to see things that maybe wouldn't come clear on the webcam. And it also allowed us to quiz ourselves um, regularly. We don't have to worry about pulling out the cadaver in order to get access to it. We have, uh, the class is large, they divide it up. So we'll have half the class in here on Amitage one day and then the other half would be doing cadaver lab. Um, so that way it's not too crowded. Um, but I believe that we were able to get a, you know, I think one. Some days, some days, some days, entire class was yeah. uh, just uh, to have idea yeah. what is an atomic and table. And because the table is so large, everybody's allowed to just kind of get around it. You don't have to worry about that. Um, and the images are so clear, it makes it very easy to visualize what you're looking at. 